hello. Hello world. Whoa. Let's turn this down a little bit. Can you hear me, internet? Oh my god. So, it's good to be back. It's Thursday. Um, I had such a delay with the stream that I went live at the same time as Critical Role. So, I know who you are all watching. It's me. Yeah, we set up. My husband got an Xbox S series, I believe is what this is. This little device. And um, it is mine now. And I had to set the whole darn thing up again. Oh boy, I just called Samoon on accident. Whoops. Um, so yeah, that took a hot second. And I'm just checking out all my goodies here in OBS. Can't tell if the game is barely audible. I guess we're just doing like a campfire situation. All right, we'll we'll play with that. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited to be back. I took last week off for Thanksgiving, and I have missed this game. I've missed all of y'all. So welcome in. It's, it's been a minute. Um, for those of you who are just reminding yourself of how cool this game is. Uh, we we drove through a wasteland. Let's see if we can get a good view here. Turbo Jerky says, seems quiet, but it might be a quiet game. Yeah, I don't know. Let's see if I can raise the volume on the computer itself. Oh, that might work, actually. I wonder if you can <laughs> hear the volume ding thing. Well, it works for me. I don't know if that works for all of you. Give us a glide. Ooh, good, good call. Oh, my footsteps are significantly louder now. Let's get a good glide on here. It's weird, it's like the volume is, um, I would say inconsistent. All right, well, let's see if that works. You hear the glide? Okay. All right, well, you know, let's just dig into it. Thanks, Turbo Jerky. So yeah, so we traveled through a wasteland Oh, cool, the sun is rising. That's really neat. That's six in the morning. We're here for sunrise, guys. And it's so pretty. This desolate world. Um, so yeah, Samoon is probably trying desperately to get up here because I accidentally called her. Sorry, girl. Where is she? There she is. Oh, she's trying so hard. I wish I had a stop trying Samoon button. Like, I really want to just go down there. Should I just go down there and tell her to chill? I feel like I owe that to her. Because we are not... We are not going any lower than this. Sorry, girl. Um, yeah, so for those of you who didn't know, I upgraded my bike. It looks like a disgusting maggoty fly. The eyes symbolize... My spy alter ego, the shade. And yeah, goal today is just explore this. If I recall, these guys harvest crystals. So that's why I have this cool backpack. And I think, let's see. Let's get to solid ground here for a sec. I think I am one away. Oh, maybe I have enough. I think she only wanted 20 eggs, so. 
But I don't think I can teleport back here is the thing. Yeah, I haven't really unlocked anything to teleport back here, so... Let's figure out what's going on here first. And maybe get some stamina later. Yeah, I feel like it's been a while since we all hung out together, so... Let's catch up with my crystal grandpas here. Remind me about this place, sir. Oh yeah, they make that cool noise. Okay, okay. Okay. I am ready. Let's see if this guy still has my, uh, my stuff. He does! That's cool. Lightning crystal. Neat. Alright, onward. Hey, welcome in, welcome in. We are just about to start exploring this place. Okay, so cool. Oh, wow. The green screen looks like garbage. Hold on. mess with this. Is that better? Is that worse? Ah, that's better. All right. I think I'm getting the hang of this, you guys. Troubleshooting live? Oh, wait, now I'm a ghost. <laughs> I can't win. <laughs> oh, no. Making more trouble live is what I'm doing. I'm just gonna be wibbly sometimes, it's fine. All right, I really thought there'd be a glowworm back here, apparently not. Let's see if we can climb these bad boys. Oh, so cool. Oh my God, what? This game. Did you see that? That was so neat. Let's see if I can come on the other side here. Look at that. So cool. What's over there? Some kind of ship thing. Was I already over there? Interesting. Onwards. Yeah, this green screen is not liking dark backgrounds, that's for sure. Good thing we're in the crystal caves. Oh, cool. So I think this was the statue that I saw from far away. Something about lightning. I should have listened to those old guys better. Oh yeah, so cool, okay. Yeah, we've got the same outfit. Wow, I really like these statues. I can't, I honestly can't tell if those white flashes are supposed to be weather or if my game is just glitching terribly still. These guys are so cool. Wow. D 
Do you think I could go in there further? Was that the entryway that I came in? They look like they're made out of jade. If I were to guess. So cool. Let's go down there. Let's just double check. Oh my god, there's nothing here. How disappointing. Okay. Fine, you got me. Keep down here for nothing. It's fine. We just had to know. For the hard road ahead, people. Climbing back up to where we were before we made a huge mistake. Oh, it's like Stranger Things music meets um, being inside a volcano. I'm digging it. Come on, Sable. Cut me a freaking break, will you? All right, all right, we'll go the way we're supposed to go. Here we go. I'm following the path. Man, did you hear that? When I ran, I jangled like I had a million crystals in this backpack. It's so melodious. It was, what did you clip? Did you clip me falling off and then just being faced with a blank wall of sadness? <laughs> I will check that out later. I really hope that that is uh, my gaming highlight. Are, are you kidding me? This is because I didn't get that stamina. But welcome in, Knuffles. It's good to see you. How's your day going? Let's stop, let's stop diving around. <laughs> Stay on track. <laughs> Good bliss, everything is fine. How about you? I'm good. I, I kind of missed streaming last week. I'm in the U.S. and we had Thanksgiving. Ooh, am I climbing up a very inappropriate part of this man? I apologize. Ooh. Um, but yeah, it was nice, but I'm excited to get back to this game. I missed it in the same way I missed uh, Zelda when I was really into that. Come on, Sable, get your stuff together. So yeah, work was a little rough this week, but it's almost the weekend. Hey, Turbo Jerky. Oh my gosh. I'm not seeing a lot of rainbow worms around here. Not being rewarded for my insolence. All right, let's just head up. Tomorrow's Friday already. We're almost there. We can do it. Yes, Kadoop Bliss. We can make it. I actually have more faith that I can make it <laughs> to Friday than I have faith that I can climb any sort of thing I'm supposed to be climbing in this game. <laughs> I seem to be reaching the very edge of things. It's time for a stamina upgrade. Oh my gosh, there's the lightning. Do 
you guys hear it? I'm probably gonna fall again, aren't I? It was worth it though. What? No way. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Holy moly. Look at these guys. Oh my gosh! This is wild. What is happening right now? This is really cool, you guys. <laughs> ah, look, I can get through this one. That was so neat. Oh my gosh. There's not a lot of mechanically rewarding things on this level, but it is atmospheric as hell. Know what I'm supposed to be doing here, but I feel like I'm intruding here more than any place else so far. Like, I just met these nice farmers, and they were like telling me all about their culture and means of existence, and here I am just climbing all over their stuff. I don't even know what I'm doing. What is, what is the objective here? I've got to be able to charge something with lightning, right? Okay, this guy's holding the big crystal. No, oh, come on. Hmm. Should we go climb up into that guy's hand? It's either going to unlock everything or be us just standing in that guy's hand. Oh, this is going to be tough. There's a lot of ridges. Talk to the guys at the entrance. They'll explain what you have to do there. There's a quest. Funny you should ask. I did talk to them two weeks ago. <laughs> and uh, let's see. Nope, nope, nope. Well. If it's an official quest, I did not receive it. Should we go back down? Whoa. Let's go to this guy's lightning hand first. Bring forth the thunder! So cool. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I am not seeing anything happening. 
I look great though. Come on guys, look at this cloak. Whoa. Hmm. Okay. Well, when in doubt, go back to the beginning and I guess read what they tell you. Is that what we're doing? You gotta read. Yeah, because I don't think I... Let's see, quest. No. Just have a bunch of stuff from Akria. Alright. Let's mosey on back there. I thought I talked to all of them, though. Oh, thanks for the follow, Valorjorian. Welcome in. Let's go talk to these dudes. I just can't imagine what else they'll tell me, but let's pay attention. Maybe I was supposed to buy some of their electric goop or something. Fellas, we're on a quest to get a quest. Not going down there again, that's for sure. Fool me once. Are no, I was gonna say there are no glowworms here, and then I spot one, of course. Hello, little chum. Water break. Hmm. I don't know if you guys are into Lacroix, but it's pretty much the only thing I drink besides water and coffee. And. uh... They were out of my normal flavor, so I have all these festive tall cans. <laughs> That's me letting loose. Different La LaCroix flavor. All right, friends. I'm gonna talk to each one of you individually. You're gonna tell me what the hell is going on here. You. Yep, okay, that checks out. You. Yep. Good information, thank you. You. You're the merchant. I'm gonna buy, tell me about this camp, sir. Yep, yep. Okay. Yep. I like you, you're a thinker. Um, I'm gonna take these because I thought I'd be harvesting them, but I didn't see any. Oh, I'm broke as a joke. Oh no, okay. Well, let's see. Sir, I know I just talked to you. I didn't retain anything you said. Please tell me everything. Okay. You do not look odd. Maybe a little bit. Yeah, I remember this. We were having a cultural moment. We were having a kind of a exchange of uh we're decentering ourselves. Crystal Farmer Tota. Yes. Why is there an electric palace up there? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You built it. It was made to draw lightning storms away from the rest of Hakoa. Love it. Side effect of that concentration was the formation of lightning crystals. Bro, I didn't see any tiny ones. I saw really big ones. 
Yep. 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 All that chemical and coincidence. Uh-huh. You created the crystal farmers. Love it. We worship them. What are the big robots? They used to harvest our lightning crystals, but we must do it ourselves. Mm -hmm. I think you're pretty cool, dude. Huh. I mean, really, the only thing is these lightning crystals, but I'm too poor to buy them. It's because I bought... Okay, let's be real. I'm too poor to buy the lightning crystals because I bought this bomb outfit. Look at this. I regret nothing. I don't know, friends. I mean, it was really cool up there, but... I feel like maybe I don't have the right stuff unlocked to do anything up there. Let's take a look around the other side just to make sure. But I might be filing this one under coming the hell back here one day. special, just a bunch of giant robots. Alright, let's get to a higher level. We'll circle around. Feel like we did our due diligence. It's just so cool. I really want to figure it out. Okay, let's go this way. So I'm pretty sure we went the other way before. And now the other thing is I'm not seeing any like tiny little crystals I can harvest myself. Like I don't think I can harvest these guys. Just hanging out. I might file this one under, I don't know, man. That is a huge area to not have anything for me to do, though. I'm so torn. Crystal butterfly. I don't even know how to take these things out. I think all I can do is sell them and give them to people that explicitly want them. So that's not going to help me much. Whoa. All right. Just give one more little look-see. Maybe I should have started with a win. Maybe I should have started with stamina boost. Let's see. Okay, there's a little thing there. There's like a little, uh, on that crystal. Okay, okay, okay. I saw something. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to get some leverage. Maybe we'll do a little crystal gathering. Okay. Yeah, all right. So they're generating the electricity on these crystals. When do they respawn? If 
Valorian. Cool looking game. Thanks for sharing and good luck. Thank you. Thanks for the follow. Come back anytime. We're here every Thursday. Looking at cool things and not really knowing what we're doing. You're welcome to join. Okay. Oh, they're charging up! It's go time! Go, 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 go! Yes! Sable! Go for it, girl! No! Oh, Sable, no! Why didn't she grab it? Alright, it's fine. It's fine. We're making progress. I wonder how long I have to get up there. Oh, maybe I should jump down from those guys. Got some excellent leverage. That is so cool. All right. These gentlemen are pretty far away. I wonder if she can't... She can either not climb onto the rock, or I just totally dipped that, but... These ones seem closer. Yeah. Yeah. This is it. Go, 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 Sable, go! She really can't cl Okay. So she can only climb onto the crystals. Hmm. And we need to find a crystal that's close enough. Those old men, they told me nothing. I'm not gonna let that stop me! Hello. Yes! I've done it! Oh, come on. Come on, girl. Oh, even that happens. Oh, no! Alright, that was pretty good. I wonder how high we can go. Okay, so we did the one that's kind of at the right of this gentleman. Let's try this one. It's kind of fun. I'm a real crystal harvester now. Turbo Jerky, don't be sad. We'll make it. It's all about persistence. Come on. You want to grow something. I know it. Yes. Yes. Perfect. So cool. Oh, come on, Sable. Stay with me, girl. Take it. Is this the highest we can go? I think so. There's another one over there. I don't know if we'll make it. Oh my god, Sable, I swear to god. <laughs> oh, that gliding thing. I don't know why, but I release the glide, and sometimes she latches on, and sometimes she's like, no. Okay. So, am I supposed to go bring some crystals to those old dudes? Is that 
the vibe. I wonder how many I need. <laughs> Ten's always a good number. Looks like I missed a crystal that was lower. Do these rotate? My goodness. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Let's just wait here. Mm, yeah. They're rotating a little bit. Is it not going to respawn because I'm right here? got the rest of these. Let's see. Sable. I'm just a little gumball. I'm on a fetch quest for some unknown reason. why I need to get these for these guys. I mean, they were selling them to me. I feel like they're in a good situation still. This isn't annoying at all. Alright. Just patiently wait for the respawn. It's cool to watch, though. you were going to go in order, but apparently not. Come on, Sable. Come on, girl. All right, you did it. Okay, do not fall. Thank you. Oh, why? 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 Oh, hate that so much. Is this why these old guys don't do this anymore? How many do I have? Oh, they're not there. Let's see. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. 
Where am I storing these? Oh, they're there. Oh, they are in quest stuff. Cool. All right, let's get four more. And if they ask for 20 crystals, I will cry. I also can't really tell if they're respawning or if these are a finite resource. Come on, my friends. Alrighty. God damn it, Sable. Girl. Why? Why? <laughs> okay. Four more. Four more. We've got this. Let's try a different one. It's still pretty peaceful up here. noise. All right, here I am on this thing. I'm having some real trouble climbing these guys. On crystal friends. Take a nap waiting for this. Come on, guys. Oh, yeah, there's the tall one over there. That's my cue. There we go. Thank you for not falling. Sable, Sable, work with me here, girl. There we go. Ah, oh, she makes me so nervous on those jumps now. Come on, we don't have time. Oh, butts. I don't know, man. Let's just go for the low-hanging fruit. We don't have to be a hero. Get these grumpy old men back their crystals. Or whatever I'm supposed to be doing with them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm feeling good about this one. How many more do we have? Okay, three. <laughs> We can do this. Did I say I missed streaming last week? I really meant... No, it's true. I did miss it. Ah. Oh. This game is so tricky sometimes, though. The controls are finicky. And the user error. I mean, it's high level of user error. It's really cool. All right, girl. Here we go again. Three more. Oh, <laughs> three more. Just to disable three more. You just gotta grab on. When I let go of your bubble, you just gotta grab on, I swear. Okay. Come on. 
Totally fine, totally normal. Totally not a great angle. Great, great. nightmares about this place. Is this my new Rowley's way? Really? <sighs> I dream about these crystals. I really wish that she could reliably, I could let go of Glide and she could just Dig in there, grab a hold. All right, here we go, one more time. We're gonna go, we're gonna go real careful. Re real, real, real careful, yep, yep, mm-hmm, yep. I hate it, <laughs> I hate it so much. Oh no. I don't even know where the thing is to harvest on this guy. All the way up there. Yikes. Right. I don't know why. Maybe it's the shape of the crystal? Like it has little ridges on it. Maybe she's struggling with that. Alright. Forget you, I'm going over here. This one, rolling out the red carpet for me. Here we go. Oh my god. One more, one more. We can do this. This is a good crystal. Ugh. See, it's those ridges. She's all glitchy. Sable! There it is, Sable, come on, you got this. Come on, Sable, no! Oh, no. It's okay, you tried. You tried your best. This is arbitrary, arbitrary number of crystal parts that I need. I've decided that it's 10. Oof, all right. Okay. Let's try one more. It's the video game model. If at first you don't succeed, try, cry, and try again. Bring on the storm. Try staying closer to the center, hug the wall as you jump, turbo jerky. All right, my friend. Yeah, but I don't need to, because this one spawned right here. It's done. Let's get the hell out of here. I don't even really have a quest for these. Also, can we revisit the fact that these giant robots used to pick the crystals? Their hands are way too big. Are they talking about the white crystals? Because those tiny little things are just too small. All right. Wow. We all learned a valuable lesson. Uh, just let me know what it is. Let's go try and give these crystals to these grandpas.
special delivery. Coming in hot, Grandpa! I got ten crystals for you. Please tell me you need ten crystals. Hello, sir. I would like to give you crystals. Okay, nope. How about you? Sir. Let me trade with you, buddy. Um. Oh no. Wait, how do I sell you things? I'd like to trade with you. Oh yes, sell. Wait, I'm trying to sell these to you, sir. Hmm. Okay. All right, fellas, I'm gonna be real. I don't know what you want from me. Harvested some lightning crystals. I'll be on my merry way. Can I teleport back here now? Let's see. Yeah, cool. All right. Well, if I ever need to come back here and figure out what that was all about, we'll be doing that. Come on, Smoon. Let's roll. welcome in. We gave up officially on the lightning quest that never was. Couldn't figure out what to do with that, although I did gain a lot of lightning crystals. There they are. I don't know. Someone's gonna want them. So now, I guess we could just make a beeline for this artifact over here. See what that's all about. Hmm. Ow. <laughs> Poor the moon. Ow. It's rough riding. Should try to not hit stuff, I guess. I wonder if this game would lose... Oh my gosh! Uh, would lose some of its enjoyability if there was more to do out here in the wilderness. I feel like as is, it's just kind of a big place to skim through. But, I mean, that's life, right? The world's full of a bunch of highways. bunch of cornfields, at least out our way, and only a few rest stops. So maybe it's just being realistic. Ooh, we're close. Nothing says realism like a giant fly bike in a desert planet.
Ow. Alright, where's my target? It must be right here. Oh, whoop. Is this it? I feel like I'm right on top of it. a more opportune way to get up here. I'll take the free stamina reload, thank you. Hmm. Whoa. That was unexpected. I thought there would for sure be a ledge there. Ooh. Look at this. This is like acidic puke. Hey. I'm interested. Bleh. Should I go in here? Probably not. Let's do it. I can swim. Yuck. Okay, if there's a giant something creature up there just vomiting into this pool, I will be very upset that I swam in it. Blech. This was Zelda, I would swim up that waterfall. But I'm a glider. What would gliders do? Maybe this is a softer incline here. See, I can never tell where these little ledges are. Can't plan my climb. I'm nothing if not strategic. Money! Ah, the source of the vomit. Bleh. Big ol' rock. Hmm. Okay. Getting a lot of, uh, I don't know what to do vibes from this part of the world. Should we go into the center? I don't know if we can. It's pretty high. Let's try. Ah, no, there's no way. Going right back down to the bottom. Is that something of interest up there? I think I saw that from up high. Uh -uh. It's like a weird spidery thing. Oh, they're everywhere though. Maybe it's just a plant. Not even gonna try. Not even gonna try. 
this moon. Let's get out of here. This is just a vomit volcano. Okay, so that's the volcano part. Yeah, not impressed. Man. I don't know if she can get around this thing. I think I've cut myself off from some moon. Let's see if we can do a little shortcut here. worth investigating. We found a glow worm. I wonder if we could just check out this area of the map here. Seems like a big omission. Yeah, let's head east. Not getting, not getting a lot from this area. I thought I was going to be really interested in it, but it's so desolate. And I do not understand what I have to do with those lightning things. Ah, so let's uncover a new part of the map. Good old bug mobile. I feel like my car has slowed down significantly. Maybe it's just some not ramping precariously off of things. My whole ninja fly vibe is a little weird in this desert. I felt a lot, a lot more blending in in the other area. All right, all right. Feel like I've been here before. Maybe I just haven't gotten the balloon in this area. Okay, there's a goal. Wow, I have not been here before. Holy cow. I mean, we saw bones leading up to that um, Eerie's area. But these bones are just buried in the sand. I wonder if they're the same creature. like a big playground. I'm not seeing anything in these bones, though. 
I mean, they look fun to climb, don't get me wrong. Bones, bones, and more bones. And like, look, there's these tiny little bones that are buried alongside the bigger bones. What's that all about? Were these, they're young? Did they eat them and then their bones were still inside the skeleton as this thing decayed? It doesn't seem to make much sense. Okay. Mm Pretty cool. Ooh, here's a ship, you guys. As if we weren't already upset about the puzzle. Rowley's way. No, no way. That can't be the ship. No, Rowley's way is up here. The ship that haunts my dreams. So maybe there's a couple of ships called that. Hmm. Maybe Rowley's Way is the company? Well, oh, it's terrible to see that name, though. That was the puzzle that was really glitchy on me. And it took me too long to finish it. Huh. There we go. See if we can get this little glowworm chum. Maybe I should put on my desert gear. Although I do think that this Hakoan top is the coolest. Coolest outfit I have. Just enough height. Perfect. No, come on, Sable. Oh, don't make me look the fool. Yikes. It's not our day today. It's just not our day. Did I have to go a millimeter higher? Was that the problem? Let's go check it out. We'll go to the ninth of vertebrae. Unless there's a way I can blast straight up into the air, I don't think that uh, it's getting any better than this. Maybe I need to go closer. Come on, Sable. What? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh my god. I have a stream, you guys. Like, I'm streaming this game. This is my gameplay. Yikes. I am just not good with, uh, achieving my goals today. Let's go right for the old wormy. just cruel. You know, like, at some point it's just cruel. What the heck? I really feel like that is the tallest point around here. Hmm. Oh, what if I have to ramp off of it? No. Yes. Let's try it. Oh my god, what a terrible idea. <laughs> What a terrible idea. I hope it works. Okay. Well, its tail isn't down, so that's annoying. Okay, let's go up there and then just like 
really line it up. Really line it up right. Okay. I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get up there. Let's see. Alright. Slow and steady, Simon. This is this is clearly the way that we're supposed to do this. <laughs> oh, maybe I gotta ramp up this way. Maybe that bone is a red herring for how I'm supposed to get up there. Yeah! What's up? I feel like there was potential there. Let's try that again. She loses all that air time. Center of Brunswick. Yikes. Alright. I'm just gonna try to jump myself. <laughs> cool. Alright, let's see if we can coast down from here. Probably not. That's far. Dang it. Labyrinth of Bones has me confused. Mm -mm. Just have to find the one with the right altitude. Because as soon as I can get on top of that ship, I think I'm good. Sable, I can't... I can't even... It's just like between the two of us. I don't know. I don't know how we're ever gonna get up there. Ooh, a nice little lollipop. So I just needed to find the rock that was directly next to the ship. Mm-hmm. kind of unimaginative that I couldn't find another way up there. Let's see if I can even climb this thing. That thing looks really round and tough to climb. This ain't gonna work either. Of course this ship says Rowley's way on it. Am I supposed to just climb in the butt again? get that. That's the real problem here. Hmm. I'm coming back for you. I don't appreciate this ship. Ugh. No, I just want to call some moon. How? Is it something with the bones? <gasps> the word. I found it. Awesome. That is so cool. Oh man, that is cool. I'm so excited. I think I trapped my ship up a rock, but you know, I can go get her. The moon? Did you fall? Oh, there you are. Samoon, we have found the worm after all these years of searching. Gosh darn it, how do I get that? Rude. Can I teleport back here? Look at that. 
Alright. It's worm time. Is it petrified? Do you think that it's the same type of creature that all these bones are? No, it could be. Those look like mammals. Wow, let's go up there. Okay, but I, you know what? I think I'm going to go get some stamina first. Let's go talk to my lady. Hey, welcome in. We are just about to get some stamina real quick. And then we're gonna go back to investigate a worm situation. Hey, Sammy, welcome in. I am powering up Sable here. We had a rough go of it so far, I'm not gonna lie. I had, I had some, some issues climbing things. Let's just put it that way. How was your day going? Sammy, I only played for the first hour of this game, so I had no idea the map was that big. Yes, so, Sammy, have you played uh, Zelda Breath of the Wild? Because the part where you start this game is very much like the Great Plateau. Yeah, okay. So yeah, it's the Great Plateau area. So you're gonna get some spoilers here, but um, yeah, there's a giant queen chum, as they call them. And that's where we get our stamina. We're powered by her tears. It's so great. I really thought this was a small indie game. You know, it is. There's a lot of, um, I would say there's a lot of emptiness in the world. Like when you're cruising through it, there's just a lot of shrubbery and stuff. Um, so I haven't done too much exploring like I've done in Breath of the Wild. But there's, there's a lot of landmarks. So I don't want to spoil the whole thing for you, but... You can kind of cruise through here. There's ships and waypoints. It's pretty fun. I won't show you the whole map in case you come back to it. But today we're just in the, um, well, we were around this area, which, yikes. We, we're not gonna go back there right now. <laughs> um, but let's head back to the desert. All right, where were we? Ah, yes, we were about to climb inside a giant worm. I also ad adjusted my bike for the first time, so it looks like a disgusting fly. It's a choice. <laughs> Sammy says, LOL, I love it. <laughs> Good. Yeah, it's aesthetically pleasing to some. But yeah, this game is pretty good. It has its glitches, uh, which can sometimes make life a little tough, but overall it's really peaceful. Hello. <laughs> Well, clearly we got to climb up this thing. <laughs> All right, <laughs> here, here we go. 
yeah, that's why I kind of stopped at a couple moments where the bike just got stuck on terrain. Yeah, I had a couple moments. Um, actually, the VOD is on my YouTube channel. It's, it's a trip. Um, it's like a two-hour glitch fest in one of the temples where there was supposed to be this um, pillar that pushed me in the air, and I can jump up there with, like, the key that I need to put in. And the pillar would not push me. So I would just stand on it, and it would, I would go right through it. And it took forever. Um, so I kind of have PTSD <laughs> from, from the temples in this game. But then there's just some really nice moments, so... It's a mixed bag, but I like it overall. <laughs> yeah, it was a little rough. I think any sane person would have stopped playing, <laughs> but I was determined. Ah, oh, this is cool. It has some great views in this game too. I love the colors. So the other thing, I don't know if you adjusted this on your game, but I got a hot tip to change the display colors. So right now I have it on high visibility, but the, the cool thing about it is that it changes color with the time of day. So this is actually what it looks like right now because it's four o'clock in the morning in the game, which is also beautiful. But yeah, you lose some of the nuance. I was in a city and I couldn't see where I was going really, so I changed it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And then when you're in a really shaded area, it just really takes out almost all of the color. So it's pretty monochrome, which is a neat effect. But like I think in the first temple area where you start, it does that. Um, but yeah, it's a little hard to judge distance. <laughs> but yeah, have you been playing any good games recently? Oh yeah, it becomes one color during nighttime. Yeah, it's cool to watch the sunrise in this mode though. Whoops, whoops. Oh, Sable, don't do this to me. Okay, I think we can drop down on the back of it. This is desert power. Yeah, I'm gonna put the color back on. Good morning, birds. Sammy, yeah, I just got Shadow of the Tomb Raider, a little obsessed. I have not even seen gameplay of that yet. When did that come out? Oh my gosh, okay, here we go, here we go. Oof. Interesting. Ew, what is this? Ew. Ew. Oh my god, did you hear that noise? No. Okay. Uh. Alright, let's read the diary that's apparently in here. Oh, it came out maybe two or three years ago? Maybe I have seen it. I saw one where I think she was like, it started out where she was at school or something and then she got pulled back into some kind of winterscape. I don't know. Um, the gameplays always look pretty neat. I thought it was a new one, but I missed. All right, let's see what, what kind of book is in this worm. Yeah, I did not expect to find a diary in a worm either. You told me to look to Perausta when I had lost it all, and I am here with nothing and no one, alone at the end of all of my failures. 
Yikes. I will sit and think for a while. Perhaps something will come to me. Otherwise, I look to fall. Anna, I know you wouldn't, you won't want to hear me, but I have to tell you, P. Rousta spoke to me. In a voice like rolling thunder and late evening shivers, she shook my bones and told me that there is more to this than I know, that I must look inside the statue. I have no way inside, but I will find one. Where I am bidden to go by Pirasta's whim, there I will walk in her great shadow. What the actual hell? Look inside the statue. Okay. I see your riddle. Look inside the statue. This game really messes with my head. I don't know what to do. Okay. What time is it? Six in the morning. Okay. Check and check. Look inside the statue. Ooh, I assume this is the statue. Even though it very much looks alive. It's got pus and teeth. Ooh, and a noise. Okay, okay. File this one under. I don't know. Look inside the statue. Do I have a mask for this? I feel like I have a sound lag. Huh. I wonder if you guys are getting that. Interesting. Um, look inside the statue. I don't think I have anything particularly interesting to put on for a mask. Yeah. Guess I'm coming back here. Today is the day of exploring places and being like, oh. Yeah, I definitely have a sound lag. I wonder why. Let's see if there's any worms hiding out in the back here. Oh, there's one. Wow, that lag is bad. Sorry guys, I don't know how to fix that. Well, that was esoteric and weird. Um, I liked it. Let's go check out that oasis over there. I feel like this is the explorey area. It's the moon, let's go. Okay, there's the cartographer. Whoa! That's something I've never seen before. <laughs> Sammy says, I love the butt of your fly bike opens. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's pretty great. <laughs> this bike is disgusting. Oh, let me put on my fly outfit. So I became a creepy Robin Hood type figure to this one town. And I have a matching outfit. Oh, actually, here, check out this mask. It's pretty great. <laughs> it's my favorite mask. All 
right. So a few interesting things here. I really am digging this amphitheater. That's cool. We should probably unlock the cartographer. And what the heck is that? Is it a temple in those bones? All right. This desert is interesting. Let's take a pit stop. Whoops. Sorry, Simon. Yes, thank you. All right. Sorry about the sound lag. I don't know if you guys have that on your end, but it's like a whole second behind what I'm doing. This is my first time with a capture card on Xbox. I've usually been um, cloud streaming, so. Whole new world. Are you kidding me? I don't have enough stamina to get up there. Oh, so close. I don't think I could have flown down from the worm over here. No, that's too far. Okay. Are there any tall rocks nearby? No? Man, okay, the desert is cool, but it's full of things that I can't figure out. <laughs> this is like, when I went to the edge of the map in Breath of the Wild and found all this weird stuff that I wasn't strong enough to fight yet. All right, let's check out this temple. Perhaps we can figure out something today. Today's the day of what is happening. <laughs> Let's check this out. Okay. Center of Brunswick is that ship. Purasta's ruin is what that crazy person was talking about. I guess I shouldn't characterize them as crazy. The, uh, the true believer of Purasta. The watch. Petrified forest. Okay. So maybe that amphitheater is called The Watch. Does that check out? Southeast? No, not sort of, maybe. Okay. Oh, it sounds fine, I think Sammy says. Okay, good. That's just on my end then. Got all turned around. Here we go. All right, let's explore this ruin. What kind of a creature is that? Is it a ram? Like that kind of looks like its tooth. Oh, cool. And it has one big nostril. A weird face. And okay, those are the antlers going into the rock. But it, oh wait, it doesn't look like it's attached to the skeleton, does it? Hold on. Hold on, I have no time for your game sounds. I have to take a look at this skeleton. Let's see. I don't know. It almost looks like the skeleton is resting on that. But maybe that's just the color. But like even the way it's attached. Not, that's not how skeletons are attached to skulls. Weird. All right, now I'm ready for you. What do you, what do you got? Ooh, a station. What a surprise. Marrowbone station. Love it. Hey, guys, just climbing up the side of your building. What's up? Oh, all right, viewers. Um, we might be able to see one of the most disturbing elements of the game, the mask man. There he is, being a little creepy in there. We'll come back for him. Let's see what else this station has to offer. Hello. Mm. 
Okay, thank you. Oh, Elizabeth, here you are. I was just thinking about you too, kind of. So I met this NPC, I think in two places. She was in the first station and then I met her on a bridge and I guess she's following me here. I read a conspiracy theory online that she is actually the culprit. Um, there's a mystery in this game and you get to collect clues and figure out who does it and it's never really clear who does it. But uh, there's, there's a deep cut conspiracy that Elizabeth is behind it. Which I appreciate. Such a hurry to get to a Kriya and become a guard. Would you like to? Hmm, interesting. Okay, so those plants only come out at night. Maybe I found some. Open up a Nemoor plant and bring me whatever's inside. <laughs> I bet that's exactly what it is. All right. Did I already get that? Let's see. I don't know if it would put it in quest or general. I grabbed something. Prickly pear? Did I? No, I didn't. Okay. All right, we'll go on a little night mission later. What else do we have here? I like how if this game had anything that hurt me, I could sleep here, but I'm always fine. Hey, friend. All right. Give me a job. I can't tell you where she is right now, but I saw her. But when I saw her, she was looking for the sleeping singers. They're a set of stone whales? What? Yeah, okay. That was a weird tidbit. Thank you, sir. Everybody needs something. Orange ring beetles. Okay. Our love of tasks is greatly exaggerated, sir. Mm hmm. <laughs> the gliding is just sand in your bits. Love it. It's a nest northeast of here that should be a few. Or that I should have a few. Okay. Orange string beetles. I've collected so many different kinds of beetles. This guy has a beetle on his face. <laughs> that is wild. I thought my game was glitching out. <laughs> but his beetle is flapping. All right. The second you approach, they'll burrow to get away. You'll want to lure them over to somewhere. Are these the beetles from like level one? Interesting. No, apparently that's a different kind of beetle. I have so many things to find now. Let's see. Looking for glowworms. Interesting. All right. Got a lot of beetles to dig. Gotcha, gotcha. Is there somebody else in here? Sammy, oh my god, I was the beetle. I also thought it was some graphical thing. Yeah! <laughs> I thought it was just glitching out. <laughs> He's got a little beetle face. Ah, there was someone in here. Oops, sorry. Hello. Orgit. Orgert. My clan has always been in the wash. We rarely ventured beyond its borders. 
They say chalk mounds were once bones of dead creatures killed by the fall of the whale and left to erode over time. Dang. Yeah, man. It's a bit creepy to think about, but the thing that really gives me the spooks is that petrified forest. You can hardly see your hands in front of your face in there. Okay, maybe I'm going to turn off the bright light because I think the forest is supposed to be dark and spooky. So we'll go out at night and be spooked. All right, let me turn on the lights now so I don't forget. Because they mentioned glowing stuff, so... Maybe I'm not getting the full, the full feel of it. Okay. Pr productive town. What else we got here? Does anyone fix my bike here? That'd be great. All right, scrapper friend. This is where I get all my money, selling scrap. Oh, apparently you do not sell scrap. Just the one guy, huh? Great. And it doesn't look like there's a bike repair person here either. Let's check it out over here. I guess I did come in the back way. I just plum climbed up the back of their town. So, I started streaming long after I started playing Breath of the Wild. I really, really wish that I had been able to stream my gameplay, my first playthrough of it. I was all over the place. I had no, no spoilers for the game. I knew nothing about it. I took the back entrance to, um, it's not Mount Doom. What is that called? Death Mountain. Death Mountain? Whatever. The the evil mountain <laughs> full of lava uh, and Gorons. And um, I climbed up the back of it, straight up the back. And I did not know Goron City was there. I was just climbing the mountain. Uh, and I guess that's my vibe for video games. I'm just like climbing up the back of things on accident. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Kalan, good to meet you, my friend. I'm gonna be honest, Kalan. Things are a bit challenging. All right, I'm into badges. Let's do it. What do you want me to do, friend? Report on something to me. Okay. You need to use your head for this one. <laughs> well, clearly, I have a good head on my shoulders. Uh, all right. Go to the watch and take a reading of the sun. You'll find the equipment a bit outdated. Great, great. Oh my gosh, I've heard about this. I had a little mini spoiler that this is the hardest puzzle in the game. Great. It's the perfect puzzle for me today. <laughs> Uh, all right, take the reading, and if you do it right, the face door on the central chamber should open. Once you've seen what's inside, come back here and tell me about it. Great. Oh, boy. Okay, we've got a lot of quests. I don't think I have any fun bike parts right now. Oh. Wow, okay, my other bike's a little bit faster. This one seems faster. Hmm. desert vibe going with my bike. Oh wow, they handle so differently. Okay, yeah, this one definitely turns better. The fly bike is just flying all over the place. Alright, 
let's see what masks we can get. For those of you who have not yet seen the mask giver, he is he terrifies me. It terrifies me. They they seem very um well they're very ethereal. I don't think this is from this world. Hey, thanks for the follow, Nibbler. Welcome in. Alright, we're it's about to get spooky in here. <laughs> it's about to get really spooky. I don't like this guy. Okay, the mask caster. Here we go. Wait, I'm not ready? I don't even have badges for the oh no. Hold on. How embarrassing. Yikes. Wait, what about this one? Oh, I already have the merchant's mask. And the scrapper's mask. Okay. Darn it, I need this badge. Ugh. I'm low on beetle badges. I've got this one. Weirdly, I don't have the climbing badge, although that's what I've been doing the whole game. Okay. Guards. All right. Sorry, guys. You can't see the creepy mask giver this time. Hopefully, we'll be back soon. I would say let's go for the mechanist's badge, but I do know that that's one of the hardest puzzles, and I have had a hell of a time with basic stuff in this game today, so... I think maybe, maybe we'll save that for a day where I'm more caffeinated. I don't know. Sammy confirms it was Death Mountain. Thank you for that. I don't know why I couldn't think of that. I just kept thinking of Mountain Doom. Oh, cool. Okay, this must be the petrified forest that they mentioned. Now, is this where the beetles are? What's over here? No, where's my quest log? Oh, there we go. Yeah, okay. This is Elizabeth's thing. I'm up for it. Let's get the map first. I'm up for a spooky night in the forest. Let's get a good climbing outfit going. I like the, uh, the long flowy ropes. Let's do that. Looks pretty good. Free refill. I wonder if I have more stamina beyond this. The symbol looks pretty complete. <laughs> I kind of wasn't paying attention to the queen earlier when she refilled my stamina. I just assumed that I had more. Oh dear. already. Let's get spooky. Why do I climb up here? It's so oddly shaped. Huh. Let's go for this one. There we go. Hey, we did a little wall jump. That was pretty good. OK. 
part of me wants to turn back on the, the high res so I can see what the heck I'm doing, but it's the full experience of the petrified forest, I guess. Hey, thanks for the follow, Mick. Mick Jack X, welcome in. How are you guys doing tonight? Or this week, I guess. It's the end of a long week. Hope you're doing well. Oh my gosh, okay. I feel like if I approach it, I need to get to that little ledge, it looks like. Even with all the stamina in the world, I'm still worried about falling down this darn rock face. Ooh, guys. Spooky shadows. The moon must have just risen, yeah. That's so cool. Oh, wow. This is hard to climb. It is eating my stamina. Yikes. Come on, Sable. You've got this. This is what we've worked for. Ah! And we're rewarded for it. Sounds like we're almost there. Man, what kind of rock looks like this? I think I could climb up here. Might be too steep, but I'm gonna give it a try. Oh no, I fool they fooled me. No. Gosh. Okay. Yeah, that's too deep down there. Maybe I'm coming at this the wrong angle. Zoom out a little bit. I gotta get to this big guy so that I can jump on those little things. How do I get to the big guy? Can I climb from the base of this? Let's, let's see. I don't know if I can go upside down. Oh, and this eats my stamina so much. All right, Sable. This is an experiment. Oh my god. Oh, wow. This is a little nauseating. Up, up. You want to go up? Oh. I think we were close. Okay. Maybe I can jump at it from this hill? No, it's lower. What the heck to do? Tree climbing? I really want to get up on top of this thing. Yeah, let's take a little rest. Good, good, good. I don't think this is going to work, though. Maybe. All right, Sable. <laughs> just, just a little grab. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, okay, cool. That's cool. It wouldn't have worked anyway. All right. Yikes. All right. Oof. It really looks like some kind of path. Up, 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 up. Where'd I park some moon? All right. 
When in doubt, try another angle. Samoon? What kind of world looks like that? Nick, you know, it's a good question. The lore in this game is interesting. There are spaceships in this game from London. This we know. So my question is, did the ships crash from London onto this desert planet? Is this some kind of post-apocalyptic London? Is it a proto-London before the London that we know today? I don't know. I also don't know how to get up here. <laughs> ah. Have you played this game before, Nick? Sammy, the bike is so pretty. Thank you. It's my good girl, Samoon. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, sorry, and Turbo Jerky, you redeemed Hydrate, didn't you? Here we go, cheers to you. Oh, my fancy LaCroix. We're getting crazy in here. Um, I know they're from London. The Blair, because the, well, I know the ship is from London at the very least, because the spaceships that I've been finding have London printed on the boxes on the inside. Now, it could be an Easter egg in case this game is made in London. Um, but I'm taking it as canon lore. And look at that. We got somewhere. I didn't even know we were doing that. <laughs> it's not really paying attention. <laughs> All right. The secret to success is not trying. Because when you try, you just keep falling. I don't see any glowworms out there. Pods, glowing pods. Maybe they're not visible from here. <laughs> Mick Jack, someone must have driven them on the wrong side of the space lanes. <laughs> That's very true. That's how you can tell. Okay, I think we're doing it. Just have to not fall. Come on, Sable. So some, I don't know if this is user error or the game, but sometimes I really have trouble when she comes out of a glide to catch onto the wall. And it has led to some really nasty spills. Wait, was this where I was before? Oh my God. We made no progress at all. I was so excited. <laughs> I've been here before. Oh gosh. Thanks for the follow, Game Freak TV. Appreciate it. Welcome in. Um, we are making incremental progress here. And the sun is coming up. But I can hear my cartographer's song. We're getting close. Oh, is that all I needed to do? I was trying to go for this big mushroom over here and it was not ever going to happen. All right, all right, I'm feeling good about this. I'm just so worried I'm gonna fall. Okay, come on, let's be brave. Ah! Oh my God, this is wild. Here we go. These look like fungus, don't they? The little upside down mushrooms. Sable, did I pass him? Is he lower than this? Okay. I'm going for it. I'm just gonna go to the top. Oh my God, Sable, grab, grab. Okay. Oh, okay. That was close. Okay. 
Game Freak TV, this art style is definitely unique. Yes, it's beautiful sometimes. Oh my god, Sable, please, please, please just grab it. <laughs> I'm so nervous right now. She's not grabbing it. Sable, please just climb, climb. You can do this, I believe in you. Oh my god, she's gonna fall from here, okay. Maybe if I go at it from a running leap and talk very quietly. Oh no. Why am I at a weird glitchy corner? Ooh. Can I climb up over there? Oh my god, you guys, I'm sweating. I've got sweaty gamer hand. <laughs> I'm not even good at this. Oh no. Please climb, Sable. Oh, we made it. That was, that was not even that intense. I don't know why I was so nervous. I just did not want to climb back up, <laughs> honestly. Okay. You ever see me play a high pressure game? You won't, you just won't. I can't handle it. I make it high pressure. Hello, sir. We've made it. We ran into a little glitch there, but we're here. Where'd you come from? <laughs> I love when she says the things I'm thinking. I clearly came from below. Um, let's see. Big Jax, yay, thank you. <laughs> yay, we made it. All right, let's find out some info first. If you're feeling adventurous, head west through the Badlands to the Black Sands of Hakoa. Been there. To the north, you'll find Sand Sea. Interesting. I know that word. I don't know if we've been there yet. Um, what can I find in this region? The petrified forest is wonderful. If you venture inside, you might see some of the giant geodesic stones. Hmm. And what fun creatures you might find lurking nearby. Cool, cool. Marabone Station, got you. <laughs> okay. And if you've never seen the watch, there are a few engineering feats quite as resonant. All right, all right. I'll go check out the difficult puzzle, if I must. And finally, Pierrasta, the giant worm. Most people will tell you it's just some ancient monument, a tribute to something. Tell me the secret. But I think it may have once been alive. Been alive once. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh, yep. It's got teeth and juices. No one's gonna tell me the secret. Oh, do I not have money? How awkward. I don't have enough money. <laughs> to buy the freaking map. Oh, I don't even need this badge. Is there like a collect them all thing? Like, is there a reason I would spend 50 cuts on this when I have the mask already? I'm wearing the mask. We're twinsies. Gosh, you guys, I don't have enough money. It's because I bought all of these clothes. No. Oh, wow, okay. It's okay, we can teleport back here, don't worry about it. We never have to make this precarious journey again. Ooh, money. Is there one more? No, okay, it's fine. All right, well, we're 30 coins away from buying a map, it's fine. I don't need to know where I'm going. I have some ideas. Did he talk about this thing? Not really. Mm-hmm. 
All right, so this is a good vantage point. We can jump a lot of places from here. Petrified forest at night. It's pretty early in the morning. I guess let's go check out the amphitheater. Maybe come back here at night. Let's go to this big old guy that I can't reach otherwise. Anything cool? Is there money? Oh. something. Looks like someone was camping up here. Huh. Some better climber than me, apparently. I'm so glad I made it to the top and did not bite it real hard. This is like my achievement. Failed to solve the Hakoan lightning challenge. Couldn't figure out the worm. Come by the map, okay? Let's, let's remember that, but we made it. And it's all about the winds. All right, Samoon. Let's check out this big dome. you are. Hey, girl. All right. Need to find 30 cuts, and I own myself a nice map. Let's see if we can raise up the, um, the little pod racer loops here. I wonder how many there are. Let's go for it. Forget what I get in there. Maybe it's an outfit. Slow and steady. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where's our last one? Oh, there we go. Turbo Jerky Redeemed Hydrate. Okay, I will. I'm in a race, though. Hold on. I will hydrate shortly. Yowza! Where's the last one? What? Oh, no. Okay, let's make sure I didn't miss it down here. Samoon feels like she's going real slow. You all right, girl? Okay. No, well, I guess that's the first one up there. So maybe we missed one on the other end. Full speed ahead. Perfect time to hydrate while I'm in a race. Yes. I wonder if I, I can't I actually have to hold the R trigger, so I can't even <laughs> drive one handed. I think. Yeah, she doesn't go. All right, here we go. Cheers. Cheers to you. Ah, refreshing. That gave me the energy I need. See if we can't find the last one. I don't know why my bike feels very slow right now. Like the fly bike was supposed to be slower on paper with its stats, but that thing was blasting all over the place.
Did it work? No, we're still missing one. Okay, let's take a little loop-de-loop. -loop. Come on. We're in a desert. <laughs> How do I not see it? Okay, okay. Scanning, scanning. Could it be far away? Are they messing with me? Hmm. If anybody sees it, call it out. Call that shit out. So the goal here is to light them all up and then this thing here will open up and give us, I don't know, a pair of pants or something. I don't remember. It's definitely still locked. Oh, can I crawl underneath it? What? Come on, let me in there. All right, fine. Thought I thought I was onto something. Okay. Weird, weird, weird. Today is the day of unfinished business. Is it, could it be in the forest a little bit? It's a timed event, unfortunately. So once you um, once you have them wear out, you have to do the whole thing again. What is with that weird noise? <laughs> I think that noise is from those loops. Oh, I so hoped to see a loop on this side. I'm just kind of hiding behind this rock, maybe. Like, am I overthinking the game? Or am I not thinking about the game enough? Those are my, those are my two options right now. Like, am I just blatantly missing the loop? Or is it hidden? More on this next time as we add this to the list of things we are not going to finish today. Hooray! Let's go see this dome. We're in pursuit of wins, people. Wins. Little wins. Incremental, happy spaces. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, cool. There's the worm in the background. That's neat. All right, all right. Let's check out this dome. Try again? Okay, I have encouragement. Going for it. Nibblieber, we're on it. Is it because my bike is a slow crawling sand bike? Do I need some like blasty fast bike? I mean, Samoon, I love you girl, but it's a little slow in this area. Okay. It's peaceful at least. If this was Breath of the Wild, I'd be attacked by all sorts of things by now. Riding up on horses, shooting arrows at me. I wonder if there's a mod of that game where just all of the enemies are removed. Is that a thing? All right, let's start. Let's start over here. You do seem to be going very slow. Yeah, right. All right, we got the weird crunchy noise. It's on. It's on. Go, Samoon, go! Go! <laughs> She's, like, not going any faster. <laughs> go, girl, go. You got this. 
It's so slow. <laughs> Why? Oh no, don't hit the cactus. Yeah, pick up that, that speed. Get it, get it, go, get it, go, 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 get it. Oh my god, please. Yes, yes, it's happening. Mm, didn't I do that before? Okay. Thank you for your encouragement. The bleeber. Cheers to you. Wait, it's not even on camera. Cheers to you, my friend. Glint, welcome in. Streaming in Critical Role's time slot. Gotta start sniping their audience. You know it. Anyone who likes a real good classical improv adventure is gonna love me being bad at video games. <laughs> That's our tagline. Here's the thing about Critical Role. I watch the VODs. I watch it in segments. I start it and I stop it. I really enjoy it when I can pause it. It's a very long time block to have things live and to really be engaged in the narrative. I don't know, do you guys uh, watch Critical Role? I'm a big fan of Campaign 2. I have not yet seen Campaign 1. Um, and I watched a little bit of Campaign 3, but I think I'm going to let it build up a little bit so I can kind of take it in a bigger dose. But I thought the characters were really neat. Glint, me too, it's very long. I only tried watching live once. I, the only one I watched live was um, Campaign 2's like Final Fantasy type boss fight with, uh, well, I won't say it in case there's spoilers, but that was a good one. It was like watching a UFC fight. <laughs> there was just multiple levels of, of, uh, of combat happening. All right. I know all of these things already. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, you can do exclamation point lurk, Glint, for your lurk command. Try it out, see if it works. Yeah, it worked. Thanks for coming in. Ooh, spooky. Oh, so this is the watch. Interesting, interesting. Uh, going back to color. Because I can't see very well when there's no color. Though I do appreciate that effect. Actually, let me appreciate it one more time. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely in the first temple of the game. It all looked like this. And then you step out. I think you can get a little bit more light unless... Nope, everything's just dark now. <laughs> it's night. All right. Well, let's cheat. Let's put some color on there. Guys, I don't want to do the watch. I'm intimidated. I'm very, very intimidated. I have imposter syndrome about the watch. temple. Oh, those dust motes are in the air. Very interesting. I always get excited when I see little, um, trying to think of the word, uh, gravitational. There we go. I could only think of geographical. Uh, gravitational anomalies like this, because a lot of that was happening when I got my gliding powers. And so... Always hopeful that something cool is going to happen. Hmm. 
Okay. Let's try to remember what this guy said to us. Nope, nope, nope. to use the old equipment and the watch to take a reading. Okie dokie. Nice and vague, nice and vague. Oh boy. I'm psyching myself out about this. <laughs> I hope it doesn't have anything to do with math. Just for your sake, as well as mine. Oh my gosh, look at this machine. That is really cool. Oh, cool. Okay, so we've got a sun, spider, two snakes that love each other, koi fish, uh, that animal from Princess Mononoke, and a space lighthouse. It's like my version of a Rorschach test. Um, yeah. Okay, cool, cool. Oh no. Okay, let's keep poking around. Take a reading of the sun. So, I guess end game is to just open the darn hood up here. It's good to know. Okay, so there's something over there, and looks like some stuff over- Oh, there's one of those heads. Cool. All right. Yowza. Okay. Okay, okay, there's a lot going on here. So, so far they're in the same order. And we're missing the fish? No, the fish are here. Three over there, three over there. So we're missing a symbol that's not on here. Okay. Noted. Ooh. A flash of light shines off something behind my eye, and a piece of knowledge forms in my mind. Yes, give me a hint. The sunstone manifests when the machinery is in place. Okay, so that's the missing stone. When the sun casts shadows, provide the stone the answer it seeks. Oh my god. What? Okay. So that, so endgame is not to open it. It's open. Sunstone manifests. Okay, so I'm not gonna get the stone until I figure out the machinery. When the sun casts shadows. Man, haven't you guys ever heard of an Ikea instruction manual? Why does it have to be a riddle? What 
what's up here? Let's try to go over there. Oops, a ledge, my biggest enemy. Okay. So we can't get up that way. The only thing higher than this is um, the machinery, I guess. Hmm. There's stairs that lead up this way. Secret back here. I'm thinking of this purely as recon. It's just recon, just information gathering. Right. Or am I actually gonna try to solve this bad boy? We'll see. Oh. Maybe I could get there from here. something. It sounded like it activated something. Oh boy. Okay, so that ball changed from glowing blue to dull. Dull again here. It's blue over there. So is the only point of having both of these, you don't want to go all the way around? Okay. At the very least, let's go check out that area. I may not understand your riddle, but I can use you like a giant playground. Okay, what should we go for? Let's go for the sledge. There we go. It's the same thing. Oh. It's not the same thing. Interesting. So, okay. Those symbols never change order. They never move at all. I'm just moving these planet things. Oh, we can line up those rings too. And yeah, we got some good shadows happening here. Oh, okay. Um, the sun one is lit up, though. Why? Why is the sun lit up? Do I need to go talk to this thing? Did I accidentally solve the puzzle? Oh my gosh. Let's just go make sure. Oh my gosh, it's all lit up. I'm feeling good about this. Maybe we accidentally did it. Go, 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 Sable, go. Hmm. 
Nope. 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 When the sun casts shadows, provide the stone the answer that seeks. What do you want from me? Okay. Oh, wow. So, all right. Something's happening here. So as the sun moves in the sky, it lights up different things. Okay. So at nine o'clock, it lights up the bug. it matter what these things are doing? Oh, you guys. I kind of hate it. Yeah, why would I have to move these inner things? Oh, and those, um, the Saturn-shaped walls aren't lit up anymore. Mm. Okay, and I'm seeing a nice little shadow here of this. I totally hate this. <laughs> okay. Okay, so each hour starting at 8 o'clock. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1. Cool. But why does that matter? Hmm. I'm going to have a think on this. I can't do a puzzle right now. Anyway, my brain is half broken. My dog woke me up in the middle of the night last night because he's a bad dog. He ate a bunch of dirt in the yard. It's a delicacy to him. And then he vomited in the middle of the night because guess what? You're not supposed to eat dirt. And that's why I'm tired. Because my dog is a bad dog. That's my excuse. I'm going to think on this, though. I'm intimidated by it still. I don't think it's impossible. But I also don't understand the why of those orbs. Oops. All right. I have been to the watch. I survived. I'll be back. Whoops, 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 whoops. It's the moon! We have work to do. Oh, stairs. I'll come down to you, girl. All right, that was just okay. Hmm. Don't like that, the... Not my favorite. And you know, I've never found Seven Sisters Station yet. I think what we can do is Petrified Forest. Check that out. Help Elizabeth live her best life. And then, yeah, maybe just end after Petrified Forest and stay in this area to, to noodle on that puzzle the next time I play. I will try my best not to look up spoilers. Yeah, let's go claim our prize. That was probably driving you guys crazy, wasn't it? <laughs> Whoops. Sorry to not give you instant gratification. Here we go. Let's check it out. Let's see what they give us. Oh yeah, it's just the rings. I'm collecting these. You know what we could do is go back and I don't know how many to give her, but I found a mysterious cave and she's interested in these. 
I only have three, though. Everybody wants my stuff. I wish I could advance time. I would love to see this forest at night now. We could explore a little bit in the day, though. Spooky trees aren't so terrible in the day. Oh, it's a lost woods situation. Spooky all the time. All right, let's see the colors on this. Wait, not custom. Default. Okay. Pretty comparable level of spookiness. big is this forest? Oh yeah, I don't have a map. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's not very big. Is there nothing else in here? I mean, it makes for a nice drive, but oh boy. Sorry, Samoon. No, nope. nothing really rewarding me for tooling around in here. Varying levels of spookiness. Oh boy, oh boy. It's a big forest, actually. It's not very deep, but it spreads out over this whole area. Ah, uh, these must be the things she's looking for. Okay. Good to know. I wonder what time they wake up. This is a tall tower. You know what? I'm not gonna mess around. Let's teleport down here. Doing it. Hopefully there's something cool on that pillar. Where is that? I need my, my binoculars. I really miss those Zelda binoculars. There's nothing but birds up there. Gee whiz. Oh no, there's a worm. Okay, great. Good. <laughs> the worm's movement looked like a bird for a second and I felt deeply, deeply disappointed. That's all good. Good glider. All right.
pretty good. And it's 18 o'clock. Hopefully we'll see those things wake up soon. What did she call them? Crack open a Nemo plant. Ooh, it's one of those statues up there. Those have never rewarded me in the past, but why not? Let's check it out. Oh, wow. There's more spooky stuff back here. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That looks so cool. What is up there? Another statue? Wow. All right. Spooky trees on the horizon. Dinosaur butt. It's the moon. You know you can't climb up a ledge. Oh, apparently you can. Great. Love the inconsistency. Cool. Don't know why that statue is there, but I like it. Let's see if you can get up this way. Here we go, ledge climber extraordinaire. Person? Do you guys see this? There's a person down there. Is this how I get off track? <laughs> Waiting for night to fall and I go off into the woods alone, tracking down a poor innocent person. Coming in for you, bud. Hello, sir! Hunter Vera, Rohana's mask, this place. I hate this place. Why don't you leave? I don't leave because I hate it. I have to suffer. I have to overcome my fears. Don't judge me. Okay. Awful watching things in the mists, nothing good, that's for sure. Someone told me about following the statues of the Huntress Afra. That's what I was doing. Amazing. Except I was doing it backwards, so now we'll do it forwards. Okay. Suspicions confirmed. Glad we met that edgelord. Yikes. Let's see if we can see where she's pointing. <laughs> Got a nice sound effect happening up here. Mm. All right, it's nighttime. Maybe these plants will open. supposed to collect this. <laughs> Can't really see my cursor right now. Oh, my game's getting funky. 
All right. Wait a minute. I did crack open the plant. I did that. Here I am doing it right now. Ooh, okay. <laughs> awesome. When in doubt, throw it. <laughs> I like how my destructive tendencies were rewarded. <laughs> Oh no, I'm sorry. I accidentally called Samoon again. I don't even remember where I left her. Okay, cool. Got some butterflies out of the deal. I'm into it. Maybe Elizabeth should just come out here. She's all sad because she's never seen the inside of a plant. Just come out here, girl. Smash some plants. Live your best life. Okay. Now let's follow those statues. I'd really like to see that pay off. Pointing this way. Let's see if we can get a good vantage point. I feel like the last one was up high. How's everyone liking the spooky lighting? I don't even know if I can put it back on regular. Oh, I certainly can. Okay. If you have a preference, let me know, but I think I'll keep it on this for now. Okay, that lady's pointing over that way. Let's get spooky. Everything is better on high viz, Nibbler. Yeah. <laughs> I agree. I was going for- oh! She found me! Hey, girl. It's going for the spooky vibe, but I think it's actually better when you can see what's going on. Oh! Mushrooms! Nice! about this. I don't know, guys. I kind of like the forest. They're giving me a lot of stuff to collect. Lady's pointing. <laughs> I think it was in this direction. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a mushroom. Just slightly interesting. All right. I wonder if I'll know when I've reached where she's pointing or if I'm looking for another statue. for the tip. I don't know why it always shows me this tip when I'm riding my bike. Hmm. Oh my gosh. So this is like the edge of the map over here. I'm good at finding that. even de-spookifying a little bit. Okay. Just a normal forest? No. A spooky forest. How? 
Stay there, Simoon. Not finding that payoff for the statue. Maybe I'm a little off course. I actually don't know what this goddess symbolizes either, so. Wish I had that map. I don't know. Should we just cut our losses and smash a bunch of plants? It is nighttime. I don't even know how rare these butterflies are. Ready to be smashed. Oh my gosh. I think it's glitching out on me. I just made a bunch of intense noises. Oh wow, okay. Cool. Uh huh. I don't know, friends. I mean, it's cool to harvest all this, but... And what do you think, Simoon? Ooh. Spooky? Spooky, spooky. The mists are picking up. Hmm. Nothing. Nothing interesting. Okay. I'm just on a smash and grab mission, I guess. Hopefully somebody wants these. Give me plenty. I think maybe I'll go tell Elizabeth what it's like out in the world. Just let her know she needs to live her damn life. You guys don't have to deal with COVID, quarantine. Elizabeth, get out here. Smash your own crystals. <sighs> I guess I could try to follow those statues again, but more intentionally. I just didn't see another one. There was one on pillar. And one on a rock, and then I was just spookiness. Oh, hydrate from lethargic barrel. All right. It's coming up. It's a contemplative hydrate as I think about how I want to spend my time in this spooky woods. Oh my god, the hydrates are coming in. Let's get wild. More LaCroix. I think it's almost done. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh no. The hydrate is working. <laughs> Terrible. 
take it double. <laughs> it's it's getting to me. All the pina and strawberry. All right, I'm hydrated. I almost choked to death. Thank you. I appreciate you both. I also tried to mute my mic to cough, and it did not work either. So I hope, I hope that that was um, that that was worth the redeem for you guys. All right, let's go to get Elizabeth out of this uh, stupor. Oops. Get me out of this forest. <clears throat> Yikes. All right, here we go. Amazing! <laughs> Who knew? They flit across the world along their own little paths, dancing alone on the wind but they seem so pleased whenever they meet up. A bit like us, I think. Perfect! Perfect! I can get a mask! We can call it a night! That was my goal tonight, was to get a mask. I would feel like I was lying to you if I'm like, tune in, get masks, and then I didn't get any masks or accomplish anything. All right. <laughs> that was a good hydrate, you guys. It's really sticking with me. Did I take a drink of water for fun just now, Turbo Jerky? Yes, I can drink without you redeeming points. They're just extra special when you redeem. See? Free will. Damn it! Oh my gosh, okay. I'll reimburse you. Thank you. Next on my list, I've got Hakoa. All right, Elizabeth, I'll see you there. I have a feeling I will see you in Hakoa. Okay, my friends. I'm turning down the biz for the mask guy. I apologize. The mask being, the otherworldly being that terrifies me. <laughs> Here we go. For those of you who have not been privy to the mask theme, I hope you enjoy. <clears throat> uh, masks are important to my people. I'm actually on a quest to find my self-identity as Sable. Who am I? What am I all about? And this spooky little creature holds the keys of identity and uh, mask making inside of his incorporeal body. <laughs> and I think I have enough with Elizabeth's badge. Let's see. Yep. I think I can get my first guard mask. Let's check it out. Get ready. Oh, it'd be helpful if we could see it. Here we go. Do you hear the wee -oo, wee -oo alarm in the background? Subtle, but um, does this, thing, this thing is terrifying. All right, what an ordeal, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> oh my God, so scary. 
now I have mask. Was it worth it? I think so. Oh, cool. I think, did I get guard something or other? Maybe I got guard pants. Oh yeah, a green guard pants. So I'm just missing the top. Yeah, it's the best I can do for right now. Cool. Well, everyone, it's been a journey. I streamed a lot later than I normally do because I had such a late start, but it's been fun. Come back on Thursday to uh, play Sable again with me. I usually start at 7.30 Central Time, so I should be back to that schedule next week. Um, but yeah, it was great hanging out with you guys. I'm also running an RPG this weekend, so if you're interested at all in um, role-playing games powered by the Apocalypse system, check us out on Saturday morning at 9 a.m. Central um, to noon. So we're going to be playing Monster of the Week, and I have a really uh, talented crew of players. I'm really excited to play with them. So it should be a good time. Um, I think it's going to be kind of a, a wintry theme, like a spooky winter monster. So um, yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, but yeah, it was great hanging out with you guys and we'll see you, see you next time. If you haven't followed, follow to stay informed when I'm live. I do a variety of stuff. So um, yeah, looking forward to hanging out again and I'm going to sleep. Hopefully my dog doesn't wake me up tonight. So hope you all have a good night. Take care.